Peruvian glacier gets a paint job, the climate gets a new accomplice, and Jessica Simpson morphs from meaty girl to tofu chick. This is Planet 100. Welcome to Planet 100, the top environmental news stories of the day in 100 seconds or less. I'm Sarah Backhouse and it's Wednesday, June 23rd. 55-year-old Peruvian inventor Eduardo Gold is hoping to restore an extinct glacier in the Peruvian Andes by painting it white. While splashing boulders with eco-friendly white paint made from lime, egg white and water may seem like a crazy idea, there's actually science behind it. White paint reflects sunlight, sending solar radiation back out into space and a colder surface temperature could cause mountain glaciers to reform. Eduardo Gold was one of the 26 winners of the World Bank's 100 Ways to save the planet competition last year. Now, here's Carl Burkhart with TechWatch. The uber cool fashion company Accomplice launched a new t-shirt line and environmental campaign all rolled into one. Recently, DOE head Stephen Chu made a bold statement. Making roads and roofs a paler color could have the equivalent effect of taking every car in the world off the road for 11 years. So Accomplice founders decided to lend their marketing prowess to the cause by packaging their tees in a bucket with instructions for reducing air conditioning demand by using white paint. The Accomplice Paint Project is hoping to make a major dent in U.S. energy demand by starting in Los Angeles with a painting of a major building in downtown L.A. Their hope is to get the city started down the path towards global cooling. Thanks, Carl. And finally, the vegan underground have obviously gotten to buxom Texan singer Jessica Simpson. The pop star, who famously wore a Real Girls Eat Meat t-shirt, has recently been tweeting about her newfound love of earth balance and tofu, which she dips in ketchup. You can take the girl out of Texas. And that's our show for today. See you tomorrow for more Planet 100 news.